Ooh, hey guys, how's it going? Uh, Nas here. You're watching Nostalgic. Thank you for uh, watching it. Uh, those of you who are new, uh, welcome guys. Um, thanks for watching. <laughs> Hopefully I'll see you uh, again soon. But uh, today is uh, another special video. It's uh, an unboxing. It's a trade I did recently with a fellow YouTuber and a digi friend, if you will. Uh, <laughs> his name is Eric. And uh, his YouTube channel is called uh, King Not Diecast. Check it out. Here we're looking at him from the uh, Complura here. <laughs> there you go. So uh, give him a watch. Give him check. Give him a check out if you like him. Uh, subscribe. But for now, I'm gonna open this. I still haven't sent him his stuff because I'm waiting for something to come in the mail. Uh, as soon as that does, I will send him his box and. Uh, I think he'll like it. He knows exactly what he's getting, and uh, he's excited about it. So he's a he's a really big um, what do you call them? Bone Shaker fans and Porsche fans and stuff like that. So we did a quick little trade, and um, he he was quick about it, and he sent me my box like right away. I kind of feel bad, but anyway, let's get into it, Eric. I can't wait to see this. Let's do this. Right. Alrighty then, is there a special way to open these flat, flat rate boxes? I don't think so. I think you just pull it apart. Like so. <laughs> yep. Alright, cool. So, um, I'm sending him a bunch of things. Um, if he makes a video about it, you'll find out about it. Let's fix this green, green bandana situation here. Uh, but um, I'm not going to tell you what I'm sending him. I already told you there's a bone shaker involved and a couple other things. But uh, for now, let's see what he sent, and uh, he'll get his soon. So, Eric was kind enough to send me a cat. This was in the box. I don't know. Uh, I don't know how it got there. You clean? All right, cool. Just step in some water. Yes, you did. Keep your tail out of the water fountain. Anyway, thanks, Eric. I like cats. <laughs> All right, everyone. Bye. No. All right, I'm sorry. I do weird things. Here we go. So uh, first thing we traded for was another one of these. Uh, I have one of these uh, loose and I have one in package, but I really wanted to have a second one for future. All right, why is someone calling me? Decline. Yeah. Um, yeah, you're getting the real deal here. But anyway, I uh, really love this. Uh, I collect Fast and the Furious stuff. When we first started uh, talking about the trade, um, I was asking you if you had any uh, non-premiums, because I have most of the premiums, but um, <sighs> I'm looking for the mainline releases that it actually has to say Fast and the Furious on the package. I, I want it to be, you know, official or whatever. So um, uh, Eric sadly didn't have any of those, or at least not like doubles or whatever that he could trade. So um, I'll, I'll track those down. But anyway... Uh, the stuff I got, I pretty much got for him, so if he didn't want to trade, I was just going <laughs> to send it to him either way. I know, right? I say that now, right? Whatever, nah, this is full of shit, man. But anyway, um, you got to have Brian's car, man. This is the ultimate Fast and the Furious car to own if, you're, if you like the movies. This is the first car you see in the first movie, in the first scene, pretty much, I think. And, uh, yeah, spoilers, it gets blown up. <laughs> so... But anyway, uh, it's a much better casting than the first release. Uh, first, re Well, first release was the exact same casting, exact same everything, except different wheels. And that first casting wheels, they did not look good, man. So I'm glad they re-released this car, and uh, it looks fantastic this way. So I really needed a, a, you know, a backup in my collection, so sweet. And uh, the second one was this one. Uh, same story goes for this. I needed a second one. Oh man, sadly the blister is cracked. Uh, it must have happened in the in transport. Oh man. Oh well. Uh, oh well. I guess I'll be opening this one. <laughs> so, uh, so yeah, this is from uh, Tokyo Drift, I believe. Yeah, this is from Tokyo Drift. There you go. This was the car that uh, Han and uh, Shane. Is it Shane or Sean? Sean. I think it was Sean. Uh, basically, the the star of the movie, Sean, um, 
they were doing donuts around two ladies that were driving this and that was their way to court them they were doing a donut around them and they're like hey what's up and then uh they just stood there and han's like looking at them and they pull up or he pulls up next to them and they give them their phone number you know to to do stuff with later <laughs> but anyway i really like this uh the skyline it's the uh the r33 i always liked it really beautiful car so it's nice to have this is literally a second one i have i only have one and it's in my case behind me so all right uh the rest of this oh nice eric sent me his freaking sticker so that's awesome i've been wanting one of his stickers because i've been watching him since he had like zero subscribers uh, he's one of those youtubers especially diecast youtubers that i've been following since they started and uh, he was one of them so i've uh always enjoyed his videos and uh he actually uh, we've uh I don't know if we traded we either traded before or i just sent him a care package he has one of my uh one or two of my customs the bone shakers so uh oh yeah he does he did like a whole photo montage of it and everything so um eric's a good dude and uh he's been in touch for a while and uh all right that's it there's a blind bag here and that is okay yeah so he told me we we're gonna toss this in. This is the uh, blind bag of the DeLorean, uh, not the time machine, but uh, it has like different livery on it. Um, I have one in my DeLorean collection. Um, I guess I'll show it to you. Hold on. <laughs> okay, so this is uh, some of my DeLoreans. I have, I have most of them, not all of them. Uh, I'm still on a hunt, but uh, yeah. I really like collecting these i love the delorean i love back to the future um, so the card that he sent me that's in this bag i'm not gonna open it because i have it open already looks like this so um, i know eric's expressed that he's not the biggest fan of delivery and i'm pretty sure yeah he has a loose one in his collection so i guess he had two so thank you thank you so much man um the first one I got, I got from Callie Rubin in the trade also. I never found these, never was able to find these. Right now, the blind bag cars I'm looking for are the new ones. It's the uh, Datsun 510. I also collect 510s, so can't wait to find that. Or get it in the trade in the future. Also, the BMW out of that. Uh, I don't think I need the Porsche. Uh, I do have some Porsches in my collection, but I'm not like the biggest Porsche dude. So, uh, but yeah, really cool. You know, it's not like the best one out of all of these, but you know, like when you compare that to like this beauty with the green and gold, or even like the police one, or even the, <laughs> the seventies deco, that's really cool. So yeah, I, I pretty much have all of them, uh, you know, and you can't forget the, the DeLoreans. Another one of my grails is I need to get the Super Treasure Hunt. It kind of looks like this, except it has the TH on the back fender there. And uh, I forget what else they do. I think it's Spectre Flame or something, or Bare Metal. I forget. But anyway, oh yeah, I even have the ID. <laughs> anyway, I have a lot of them. So, uh, Eric, thank you for helping me uh, fill up my DeLorean collection. Uh, so yeah, thank you for that uh, extra bonus. I appreciate it. I'm gonna put this into my collection and hold on to it for future openings or I don't know, whatever, man. <laughs> I like it, so thanks, Eric. Um, okay, what is that? Okay, all right. So let's put uh, let's put Eric's sticker on my uh, drawer of fame. <laughs> let's do it. Okay guys, here it is. Uh, the last one to join here was uh, Mark of Datsun Man Diecast. But uh, I have a bunch of guys here already. All great YouTubers, customizers, artists, all sorts of uh, great people. I've taken a few off to make some room here, but uh, <laughs> they were uh, either like just random. I, I had a Gorillaz sticker there that I just got rid of because um, this needs to stick to... Um, youtube and customizers and stuff like that so 
King Nut, you are going right here, my man. Let's uh, let's do this right there. There you go. Really happy to have his sticker. Again, like I said, I've been watching his stuff for a while. Very mellow, very nice dude. Likes what he collects. Uh, recently, he's he's been doing um, like track race videos. So check those out if you're into that. Um, so there you go. <laughs> King Nut joins the the bunch here. So yeah, yeah. There you go. Him and Mustang Hunter used to live next to each other. They were buds, going hunting together, helping each other out. But uh, Jason, the Mustang Hunter, had to move because he's with the military and he's doing his thing. So uh, there you go, guys. Really happy to add King Nut right there. All right, uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, Eric, thank you so much for this uh, trade and thank you for the bonus. I'll have your box shipped out to you as soon as possible. I'm waiting for something that you'll enjoy. And uh, the rest of you, thank you for watching. Uh, live long and prosper. And remember, don't be assholes. Peace.